So I mentioned pricing. So it's very affordable. Um, they were the first in the industry to come out with per session billing on this type of stuff. And what that means is they've, they've got a concept of authors and readers. Authors are people who analyze and develop and publish. Readers are people who go and look at it and interact with the dashboards, right? So they charge 30 cents per 30 minute session for readers to a maximum of $5 a month per person. So if I go in and I look at a dashboard once a week, I go in, I log in, I look at my five dashboards, I do them every Monday morning, it takes me 20 minutes to go through them all, that's four sessions a month. It's a buck 20 for me a month, okay? On the other hand, Don Nutsman goes in and says, I want to look at these every day and he pours over them multiple times a day and he's always in there looking at these things and coming to my office and banging on my door and saying, why is this happening? Why is this happening? That's $5 a month for him. You know, so the benefit is you can go to a lot of people and keep your price very low, but you also know where your cap is. So it's not you know, something where it's like, well, you know, Don goes in all the time. He ends up being $50 a month because he's in there all the time. They've got a cap on it. Authors are also not expensive. They charge $18 a month. Um, there's no upfront cost, no complex capacity planning. Um, we are uh, partners with other visualization tools as well. And when people adopt them, we do a lot of upfront compl ca uh, capacity planning with them. How many servers are you going to need? Who, how many people are you going to be going to? Let's talk about how much memory you're going to have to have on these servers and things like that. And oftentimes, they get a little bit freaked out by that. Um, what is it, authors? Authors? Yeah. Uh, uh, people who can create dashboards oh. and do analysis work. Uh, so QuickSight's only been around for uh, a couple of years. I think it was 2016, I think it was initially released. Was it even released? Was it only preview or was it GA released? Do you remember? I feel like it's been a little over two years. Yeah, I think it's been about, yeah, right, just a little over two years. Um, and they're making investments. And I, yeah, I'll be frank, you know, we work with a lot of other analytics tools, and when QuickSight first came out and was generally available, I looked at it and I said, this is a nice toy. <laughs> but I've also been working with Amazon, you know, for almost a decade. And I know how quickly the nice toy they release becomes a imperative product, right? So just in the last two years, they've released over 160 new features on QuickSight. And I've seen their roadmap for 2019 and looking into 2020. And I can tell you, there are a lot more features on their way, and they are pushing hard for parity with their top competitors in the marketplace. Not only parity, but leaping ahead in certain areas. So, uh, I have a question on yes. the price. So, how does how does that pricing tie back to uh, you can embed the uh, in applications or you can email reports out? So, the email reports are included as part of the regular subscription. Uh, the embedding in the applications, um, the same pricing applies for the readers, so 30 cents per session. Um, if you are uh, having people behind a login and you pass that identity on to QuickSight, they're treated just like any other QuickSight user. So if you have a thousand customers and they come in, you know, if each of them hits it once a month, they each you pay 30 cents for each of them that month, uh, but to a max of five dollars. If you're dealing with anonymous customers or a large, large, large group, just like any of the companies, talk to AWS. They'll most likely negotiate something that's that's workable for you. Very good question. Thank you very much. Uh, for people who don't know me, my name is Michael Krause. I'm the Chief Technology Officer here at Charter Solutions. I, uh, I hold three uh, AWS certifications, including Architect Pro. Um, Charter Solutions also is a, uh, an advanced consulting partner with AWS. Uh, we do a lot of work uh, primarily in the analytics-related space, um, so helping companies move analytics workloads to Amazon Web Services, including things like setting up data lakes, data warehouses, uh, data piping, pipelines, machine learning processes, uh, and all the visualizations as well.